Hello, hello, folks, and welcome back to World of Warcraft. Recording locally, 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 locally. Sorry, have to do it. OCD thing. Sorry. I, I, it annoys me, and I'm sure it annoys E. It just, otherwise, <laughs> I wouldn't be able to commentate. I'll be panicking. Oh, Christ, I'm even still recording. Kind of thing. Oh, Christ. Um. Oh, so, Blue Orc! Blue Orc. I'm sorry, I've just never seen one of these before, and it's just like, what the fuck? It's like a reject from the Blue Man group. He heard it was the Teal Orc group, and got very confused, very excited, but was rejected. Uh, let's not go with that color. Um, hmm, not bad shade of green. Uh, as you can might have tell, guessed, I put actually effort into this character. I didn't just go with the default thing. Actually, went through the things, went for the old shaggy-haired shaman look, orc look. And the orc males really don't have, a f you know, one face that doesn't look... Well, actually, maybe they have, like, two faces that don't look angry. Though sometimes, wh well, whatever way I look, either this face or another one, it do it's less that it doesn't look angry, but more it looks, like, mentally vacant. So, you know, it, it just... Weird. Um, I, I didn't really pay too much attention to the female faces, how to look through them, but it was just like, um, I know, I just, out of the way, I wasn't noticing the difference. I, maybe my eyes just glazed over. I have no idea. But anyway, I've already went through the effort of creating them and coming up with a name. And it works. Oh, yeah. Ooh, this looks cool. This looks cool. I vaguely remember seeing this ages ago as well, uh, like back originally or whatever. So that's cool. That's cool indeed. And do we start off with that totem? Cool. I assume so, because like if I go with Hunrin, you know he's his minion, his pet there, and like he has his pet there. So do we have it start off with a totem? So yeah, that's cool. Oh, seeing the horror flag makes me want to go play um, Warcraft 3 now. But I want to start with Warcraft 1 and up to 2. And to do them, I need to get uh, PS1. Unless Blizzard wants to, after they're done remastering Starcraft 1, to go remaster them. I hope they do that. I really do. Just bring it to PC. I, I'm probably already on PC, but bring it again to PC. Please. <laughs> I'd love to do them. I really would. I'll turn out one, two, three, and Frozen Throne, and it'll be beautiful. Beautiful. The weird thing about the first Warcraft Warcrafts, though, is that you play like a campaign, two different campaigns, and one is can, the other isn't. Because, like, one in, but, like, in the Orc and Human one, the humans will triumph at, uh, say, Kilkenny, and so in the Orc campaign, the Orcs will triumph at Kilkenny. Only one can happen. So. The Great Cataclysm has shattered more than just the world. War Chief Thrall, arguably the most powerful living shaman, has left his people behind so that he might stop the Cataclysm at its source. Yet, in his absence, the Orc Champion Garrosh Hellscream has become the Horde's new War Chief. Though popular amongst the Orcs for his victories against the Lich King, Garrosh's reckless leadership has begun to cause a rift between himself and the other leaders of the Horde. With Duratar's natural resources nearly depleted, Garrosh seeks to take whatever his people need to survive, regardless of who stands in his way. A dangerous new era for the Horde has dawned, and it falls to brave orcs like you to uphold the will of the new war chief and assure the dominance of your people. Cool. Though they do reference Garrosh there, who... And no, it seems we don't start off with a totem. Huh. Regardless, uh, he re they reference Garrosh there, and he won't exactly be relevant anymore. We may see him in a once-off one quest, but we let leave, we walk back, he will be gone. Uh, I remember back when I first was making Shaman, you used to start off, and when you reached level 5, you would get a stone skin totem. You know, I always, for for whatever reason, for quite a while, I thought you could tank as a shaman. I, it's only a, a DPS or healer thing, though. I, 
I don't know why I thought you could tank. Probably because paladins are tanks, healers are DPS. So are druids. So I assumed because shamans are another hybrid, so could they. But no. Actually, would they be considered a hybrid? Because if that's the case, then so are priests. And, well, any healer cost. So no, they, they wouldn't be. I think it's only shamans, like paladins and druids. There might be one other one, but I'm not sure. Regardless. Uh, I'm not, I might play as a melee shaman, I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see. Finally, you're of age, Dukar. Though looking at you, you're like 70. <sighs> Maybe that explains his laugh. Like, oh, you're of age, at last. <laughs> uh, anyway. Finally, you're of age, Dukar. Of, of age to battle in the, na in the name of the Horde. To conquer for the glory of the war chief. Yes. Kaltunk looks you over. You will do nicely. No doubt you wish to find a great dragon or a demon and strangle it with your bare hands, or, but perhaps it would be wise to start on something less dangerous. Kaltunk laughs. Report to Gornak. You should be able to assign a task better suited to the young shaman. You'll find him seated, by, uh, seated at the fire behind me. Strength. Your place in the world. Lokhtar. Another one of Kaltunk's recruits him. Uh, a sorry state of affairs we find ourselves in, if this is the best the Horde can produce. No matter, by the time we think you're ready to leave the valley, you'll be proud warrior of the Horde. Your f the first order of business will be to put a little strength in your backbone. I could send you out to the barrens to hunt Kodo, but well, in all honesty, you're more useful to us alive than dead. I believe you'll be more of use to us slaughtering the boars you'll find in the farms to the north and east of here. I remember reading on the wiki that there's some plot point but about the orcs and boars. But I don't remember like part of me is wondering like was the plot, the thing on the wiki wrong? Or you know, a you know, someone was fucking with people who wanted to go read it or whatever. I just remember people in the wiki claiming that orcs didn't really like uh you know, sort of pens with boars and whatnot. The the um we the orcs that used to be on Draenor, like the ones native here, don't have the same issue. Like the orcs slaughtered, you know, Draenei people, including their children, men, women, children, all slaughtered by them. The squeals of the pigs reminds them of the squeals of children that they were killing when under demonic uh, sway. So that's something that I remember the wiki claiming. So yeah. Well, you know, wholesome fun. Uh. Anyway, let's go cut our teeth. Actually, I remember back in pre-Kata rejig, there was a person. I can't remember the name, but they're on World of Warcast uh, as a guest. They looked. Uh, they, they wanted to see how far in the game they could go to uh, without killing anything. And by how far in the game, they mean like uh, I I mean to say, how far could they level? Um, like to what level could they get? And I believe they got to somewhere in the thirties or forties without killing a single thing. So yeah, but that is pre counter stuff, and as you can see here, uh, like in this, you pretty much start off having to kill things. Um, of course, you don't actually have to... A big way of them gaining XP was to go to places. When you discover a place, you get XP. So that's part of how they will level it. And certainly now, you can level the entire way... Once you get to level 5, you could continue um, mining and herbalism up to the rest, you know, up to max. You know? Uh, angry snort. Next sake. Excuse me. So while the quest may have been rejigged with that little addition, you could um, level yourself up that way. But anyway, uh, they, like big way they gained that XP was to do quests and, uh, well, sorry, well, obviously quests, but to uh, explore around them a lot. There's also a few. I remember one quest in reference to here. I'll look at them over there in a second. One quest I remember them 
talking about here was cactus apples or something. Um, like you could gather some fruit from the cactuses. Um, but one issue they said with that was to unlock it, you have to do a killing quest first. But yeah, that was the kind of quest they would like, where you just go gather a thing off the ground and leave without having to kill anything. What? 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 Um, screen went black for a moment there. I have no idea why. It was doing that to me. Uh, I was doing that to me the other day when I was playing uh, Warframe, uh, but then after a few t things, it stopped. And now it's at it again, playing a different game. I don't know what's up. It's never. It only seems to be doing this when I'm recording. I'm not sure if it's a recorder fucking with it. Is there something else going on? But yeah, anyway, the person. Um, sorry, my brain is scattered. But yeah, the person was um, just. I'll start at that point again. They're talking about leveling up without killing. They were going into great detail. I remember them exploring, talking about corpse runs. They made a reference to a quest here that was here pre cata I don't know if it's still here. And I think they made reference that they couldn't do it. Maybe the cable's loose in the back. Then again, I think it'll be given a different issue than this. Plus, if ye are seeing it, then it's definitely not the cable issue. There's that in. There's that in. Let's make sure it's not going to fall out. You like, clip the uh, monitor into a stand, but if you move the stand, the monitor can on hook itself. When I say clip, you like push them two together. Uh, but yeah, the monitor can undo itself. Um, but yeah, basically, yeah, they're talking about leveling up without killing. I'm, I know I'm repeating this for a third time, but I feel like I'm after forgetting a point. Leveling up with killing. They talk about how he did it. it you should go look it up. I don't know which episode of World Warcast it's on, nor do I know if you can still get it. I had to unsubscribe and delete all my episodes quite sadly uh, on my Mac because I had to make room for more recordings. Um, and um, I, I've been hoping to use my Mac as a podcast store, basically, once I get all the stuff off it. When I have this new PC to use it to store all my podcast, uh, store podcasts on it, but it never came to be. Um, so yeah. Be, oh yeah, because it glitched. Uh, there's some issue. Well, sorry, it not that it glitched. The computer bugged out basically. Ah, oh, feck. Not bugged out. It, it, there's an issue with it. it. The monitor, it keeps shutting itself off when you turn it on. Sorry, my brain is frazzled right now. I'm distracted by own, you know, no, like normal stress shit I always have going on in my head. And I'm more worried, and I've, <laughs> I've got plenty of stuff going on, so I worry about them. And now I'm panicking about my computer being busted, and my mind is afraid, you know, afraid enough as it is without worrying that this is going to break on me. Because the warranty's just run out. <laughs> Also, yes, this is a nod to the, you know that painting, you know, uh, old guy, you know, old guy and his wife standing by, you know, in front of their farmhouse. So th that's what th these are meant to be. Like he holds a pitch, the old guy holds up a pitchfork. This guy's holding up a pitchfork. It works. So yeah. So anyway, let's move on. And we'll go turn this in. Let me just make sure everyone's fine. Recording locally, 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 locally. Everything seems fine, yeah. Funny enough, when I did this the first time around, I think this was my first character I did. And now here, beyond the Dead Knight, he's it's going to be my last one. Dead Knight is technically the last one, but ignore that. Hmm, not bad, Dukar. But don't let it get to your head. You'll fight tougher than boars in your career. Nonetheless, you've proven yourself well, and your next trial will be against a considerably more dangerous opponent, so you need some extra protection. You're not just... Uh, you're not just another grunt. You seem to be a serious shaman. Good, because that's exactly what I need. Try not to let the word out, 
but since uh, since they don't want to cause a panic. But there have been reports of more humans nearby. This is an egregious betrayal of the peace that we negotiated with that miserable Jane of Proudmoor. We don't allow it, humans in Durotar, especially not here in the valley. You'll find them to the, to the south. We can't allow the humans here in Durotar, especially not here in the valley. You'll find them to the south. Say them quickly before their numbers increase any more. by me. Also, there's just south of here. I'm sure plenty of people have noticed them. What do you need? It sure gets hot out here in the... Um, it sure gets... Uh, uh, it sure gets hot out here in the Valley of Trials. Galgar wipes his brow. If only I had some cactus apples. I could make my famous cactus apple surprise. No one cools you off faster than a piece of that delicious treat. I'll tell you what, dude. Is he a, sales, a salesman or something? Because he's... It's a great sales pitch. I'll tell you what, Durkar, if you bring me six cactus apples, I'll make you a few portions of cactus apples prize to take with you on your adventures. If you're interested, you can find cactus apples growing near the cactus plants around here. And it already gives you some... it's always staff food. Okay. He's... he says... Du... Du... Uh, Dukna, this is embarrassing. He says to her. He was wielding a loaf of bread. That would actually be cool. Imagine transmogging like Ashbringer into a loaf of bread. Oh, they're sk they're stealthy. That's why no one's noticed. noticed. And and he's lazy. Ah, oh, it's very nice that they're all passive. Would this even help? Yes, this does increase my melee spell power. I was wondering would it even be useful for a caster shaman? Memory serves, um, orcs have a. Yes, they have a bonus to pet damage. 1% uh, bonus uh, to damage dealt by pets. Also, has hardiness, which reduces the duration of stun effects by an additional 20%. And they only speak orcish. Kind of like humans, they only speak common. Uh, everyone else, part of their factions, speak th their language. Which is very nice. Well, for humans and orcs, because it's a bitch to learn other languages. Believe me, I've tried. It was okay at Spanish in Junior Cert, but leaving Cert, holy oh, Christ. It was, it was a pain. Um, I remember the class being very weird. And the teacher being an arse. But beyond that, I don't remember too much about it. By really weird, I just mean, um... Um... Like, we had two ordinary level 5th years in, in the class. We had two higher level 5th years in the class. And two higher level 6th years in the class. And the teacher being an arse, uh, I don't remember the exact thing she said. I just remember she said something to... Uh, like she was having some meeting with my mom. Or you know, parent teacher meeting or something. Uh, they have them once in a while. Um, and I just remember her saying something really rude about me. I don't remember what she said, but I remember her saying it. Also, this is a minor. Uh, uh, let's see, hidden pass. Not really that hidden. I still kind of stumbled onto it. Spirit rock. This place is probably useless. A lot of class quests and whatnot were getting rid of in uh, Cataclysm. So, any little class uh, variety in questing is gone. Is gone. Hmm. I'm not seeing the elemental anymore. The minor incarnation of Earth. I don't know why it's gone. Maybe it will turn up again. I've no idea. When I was doing quests, like on all the characters I've done so far, I've never gotten any, uh, you know, class quests beyond that one on Medea, or not Medea. That was the old name for my Boy of Mage. But yeah, basically whatever I got in my Boy of Mage, uh, I got some staff quest for, and that sent me to a dungeon. Beyond that, I haven't got any quests on any of my characters. Probably because they're not—they never reached a high enough level. But yeah, 
Also, if that's the case, then that elemental definitely won't be useful to me. Anymore.